Hello, Nerdy Librarian here, bringing you another bonus content video. Since, kind of in limbo between multiple quest lines in the game, in, between the Alduin line and the and the Skyrim Civil War line, quest line. So, I thought today I would just do kind of a short, shorter video. Not an not an entire full episode, just a bonus content one. Gone fishing. It, this one's this one's gonna be all about some fishing. Let me just sneak past here. I know some decent fishing locations around here. I'm hoping to be able to complete some quests, earn some coin, and you know explore those parts of the game. And oh, can't walk across that. That's fine. Hey, get over here. Blue Darwin. Not quite the Pokemon Yanma, but, you know, close. Anyways, here we go. Let's, uh, talk to, uh, Veria. I don't know if anyone in need of fishing work around Skyrim. You're headed to Whiterun. It's all in this note. Alright. Until Ooh. next time. They want... A goldfish. W what have we got here? Ooh, read bounty goldfish. Let's let's take a look here. Bounty. I want a goldfish. I can take good care of it. Mom said that I want one. That if I want one, I should go catch it myself. But I'm just a kid. Anyone who brings me a goldfish will be my best friend. Mila Valentia. Sorry, that was probably... Uh, a terrible voice. I, 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 I usually like to do a little bit of voice acting when it comes to this, but problem being, um, I, I didn't realize that it was about a kid until about halfway through. So it would be more like this. No, no, it would not. No, it would not. That was a terrible, terrible voice. Let's uh, pretend that one never happened. But here's the thing: if I need a goldfish in White Run, I'm I'm thinking I'm gonna go to a place that's right along the river, Riverwood. Now, as long as a dragon doesn't show up here, I should be fine. I think I think there might be a fishing location here. I'm not. Believe me, I don't have these fishing locations memorized or anything. It would just make a lot of sense to have one along here. Right? Come on. Where, where's, where's the bucket of fish? Come on. No, nothing here. Oh well. I do know one that's a little upstream. If, if I need to go there, which I probably do. So, let's go ahead and head that way. And just as a reminder, this is still on legendary. So if anything decides that it wants to come and try to kill me in game. Well, let's just say it's going to be a little bit painful. So, like, if any dragons show up or anything along those lines, it, it'll get terrifying. But, in, but until that time, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment if you like what you're seeing here and you want to see more of this. Just going to do some nice fishing. You know, it's like, you take care of Alduin. You take care of this large dragon that is trying to devour souls in the afterlife and destroy the world. You know, af after that, it's like, you know, I don't really want to embroil myself in the civil war here. So instead, I'm going to go into a little bit of retirement. And what do I do? I fish. It's like, okay, you can definitely get away with that, right? Good news is, these uh, hunters down here don't really mind me. And they do, and they've got a fishing location. Use fishing supplies. The only thing I don't like is it always says you have to have the fishing rod equipped when you go to do that. It's it's like, okay, I mean I've got it on my inventory. It should just I've be been like hunting and fishing shopping in these wood. parts for years. I uh, thank you for the uh, update on that. It's not like my poaching is hurting anyone. The yarl can hardly eat every deer now, can he? Okay. 
There's enough for all of us if you want oh, greedy. Poggers. Got a got a pogfish. Got a pogfish. That was one of the ones I was needing I've been for hunting and quest. fishing in these parts for years. Okay. The only thing is this fisherman just keeps talking. He just keeps saying It's not like my poaching is Yeah, no, he just keeps saying the same the line. Can oh, every day, lovely. Now, can he? A pair of tongs. Just what I absolutely needed. Now, there are items that are much rarer catches, all of us like treasure catches, and I'm kind of hoping to get some of those. Like, I've got some, I've gotten some ancient Nord items before, it was ancient Nord dagger, I got a whole bunch of boots one time, that was back in, I want to say that was, oh, I forget what episode that was. It was back ways. That, that was a while ago that that happened. Ooh, nice carp, nice carp. No, but I mean, if I can fish some magical items out of a river, that would be great. Granted, it's kind of like Minecraft fishing, you know, where you have only a certain chance of catching certain items. And I also know that you can catch other fishing rods. I just don't know exactly where those locations are. I've made sure to not look at wikis for this sort of information, aside from what kinds of items you can catch. I have not looked up where particular items are I've been hunting and fishing at. in these parts oh, for years. Poggers, another pogfish. By the way, I'm not a Twitch streamer, but I'm still saying poggers, because it's, it's not well, like my know. poaching is hurting It's a pogfish. The you know, that's, every that's just now, the okay? joke with no, I, I don't have the sort of schedule that allows me to Twitch stream or anything like that. Mostly, I just record videos for YouTube. Actually, that's pretty much been all of the videos that I've made I've up. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for it's years. been YouTube videos, yeah. I'd... If I had more time available, I might... It's not like my I might do regular Twitch mind. streams, but at the same time, now, it's like, I kind of like having the flexibility where I can sit down for, say, a couple hours here There's and enough there, for all of us if or you want greedy. that sort of thing, or a, a few minutes, just for a few minutes to, to record I've a been video, and fishing in these parts for but years. I can't, I can't necessarily make a regular schedule out of it. I have a life it's outside not like of my poaching making is hurting videos. Anyone. Which is a shame, because this is kind of fun. It's it's fun to be able to play video games, just kind of talk your way through them, like, hey, you know, I catching, I mean, catching some ale, that's... I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Would you please stop telling me that? You've been spouting at this nonsense for the past five There's minutes. There's enough for all of us if you aren't greedy. I'm just trying to clean up your river. Yes? A, a troll skull. I should really dump some of my inventory, I think. Like, these junk items I'm catching. Like, a troll skull. Yes. I think a troll yes. skull is, what, five carry weight? And what, what are lanterns? Like, I, I'm catching a whole bunch of junk here. What, what have we got? I'm not getting rid of the amber, because I... That's part of the Sinners and Saints edition with uh, Anniversary Edition. So, I that's that's something that I did look up. Don't need to keep the firewood. So, and I'll get I'll get to that one at some point. Oh, there's Meredith's beacon. Oh gosh. There's the tongs. Yeah, trolls. Oh, weight three point five, value five. Okay. Completely restore magical with Welkin stones. You know, I I really. Ought to use you the Welkin stones just to get them out of my inventory. The thing is, though, I haven't used a lot of magic. No. Yes. He pi he picked up the empty wine bottle that I threw down just so he could hand it to me. And troll skull. What? Okay. Okay. Here here's what's gonna happen. Did I already read this? I did. I did already. See this junk here? I'm going to throw it farther on land so you can't give it back to me. Well, hopefully not. Actually, now that I think about it, the logic on that is probably going to fall hmm? apart. 
Need something? Uh, no. No, I'm, I'm good. I'm just a uh, fishing here, you know. Next, next to your camp. I, I hope it's all right. Yep, just another relaxing night in the land of Skyrim. Elephant helmet. All right, all right. I. That's a decent pull. I can sell it. Might be able to enchant it. Although I don't have a very high enchantment skill, so the results on that would be very limited. A tankard, just what I needed, thank you. We'll clean this river up eventually, but I mean... Oh boy, people are just lawless mm -hmm. with their with their garbage, with their junk, you know, they just, they just throw everything they have into the river. Mm -hmm. Like lanterns. Need something? No, I don't need something. Need something. I, just, I just want to fish. Just want to fish, friend. And he's glitching on a rock in front of me. This is excellent. Excellent. <laughs> there, there a problem, dude? Hmm? Oh boy, another tankard. You know, I, I might look up Skyrim fishing locations. Need something? Or items that you can find from fishing just just to see if i'm fishing mm -hmm. in the right location for it because i know there aren't any fishing i i know there aren't any fish left yes. in this location i'm just fishing up junk here so need something let, let me let me take a look at a wiki here i know i said i was trying to avoid them but mm -hmm. uh i'm only having Limited success. It's not like my poaching is hurting anyone. The y'all can hardly eat every day. Let's see. Um. Yeah, we're. How about uh different fishing rods? Oh, there's an ancient Nord dagger. That's that's interesting. Oh, that page has not yet been created. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, wait, that's just a normal fishing rod that it took me to there on the wiki. That's fun. More tongs. A excellent. Okay, uh, dwarven fishing rod greatly improves the chance of catching items when fishing. And there's a goblet. Here... Here's the thing. It doesn't really explain where to get that. Um, the Argonian fishing rod greatly increases the chance of catching large fish when fishing. So I think what I'm going to have to do here is look up the fishing rods specifically while I sit here just catching junk. Catching junk here. Okay, okay. Uh, looking that up, I realize I'm being a bit of an idiot with that. Because... So, I need to do more of these... More of these fishing bounties in order to get, to get up to the level where they would consider having me get a fishing rod. That's better than the one that I have. So, I'll... I'll just leave with this job. Be careful! Now, this, this does raise a question here. So, in Whiterun wanting a goldfish, um, actually, you know what I should have, you know what I should have checked here? Okay, well, okay, no, I have not caught a goldfish in any event. So, hmm. Trying to think where other fishing locations are in game. Um, well, I mean, th this is always a good place to go to. I between Iverstead and Riften. All right, Imperial soldiers, don't mind me. I am just going to catch some fish. That guy looks like he's naked over there. 
don't worry about it. Let's see. Ah, yes, here it is. Here's the fishing location. Let's use those fishing supplies. Let's use them. See if we can get anything good here. Also, I do wish there was a fishing skill tree. And maybe if the fishing mechanic was a little bit better, like a fishing mini mini game. I lost my catch. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, I kind of wish there was like a fishing mini game to this. As as someone who's played uh, Stardew Valley, the game. Like, I don't I don't know if I would necessarily want it to be like that, where you're trying to keep the fish icon within a certain bar that you can go up and down. It might be more of a... It might be more of a... Like, there was this game that I used to play on the PlayStation 2. I... Having... Growing up in the early 2000s, so between 2006 and 2010, you know, that was really the prime time for PS2. And one of the games that my that my family got got me was um, it was a Cabela's fishing game or not not a Cabela's fishing game it was a, a Rapala fishing game and one thing I distinctly remember about that is you the way the way the fishing worked on that was it had it kind of had elements of okay you've got a fish that's trying to bite at your line, but you, but rather than doing like a Stardew Valley-esque bar up and down, it was, it was more like, hey, you have to keep, you know, you, you have to make sure that you're not having your line too taut, otherwise it's going to break, and you know, you want to make sure that you're angling your rod in the correct direction, otherwise, you know, once again, your line might break or the fish might get away, or you're going to get pulled off balance and fall into the water. Something like that. Granted, I don't think the fall into the water part of it was a mechanic of that game. I don't... Yeah, no, it wasn't a, me it wasn't a mechanic of that game. But it was definitely an interesting fishing mechanic versus... You know, casting a line into a river, waiting for ripples out from it, and then just hitting the A or X button, or whatever button it is on a keyboard, to pull it out, pull the fish out. It has a little more substance to it, if you will. So, I, yeah. And then, and then, like, Minecraft. I think it I think it would be fun to be able to have enchantments for fishing rods. You know, to be able to enchant rods and maybe have fishing rods have say a durability to them. You know, where you you might have to go and get a new one every now and again unless you have an enchanted one in which case it wouldn't break because of because it is an enchanted item, a magical item. I don't know. I'm just I'm just spitballing here while I sit here catching fish for you. Like this is like I know it's it's not the most exciting thing to watch. It's it's not necessarily the content the the exciting content of say two dragons, a saber cat. The Forsworn, um, a guy that randomly goes missing during the middle of that battle, uh, the Blades, like, and if you want to watch that, that's in, uh, featurettes on this channel. It's, it's in Nerdy Library and featurettes. What, so what I'm saying is, this isn't necessarily exciting content, but it is content nonetheless, and that's a hide helmet I just pulled out of there. I can sell that, it's not gonna net me much, but... I mean, it's better than catching tongs, flagons, lanterns, troll skulls, let me tell you. You know, and I pulled out two ancient Nord daggers today, another tankard, 
So I'm let let me let me take a look at what's in my inventory because I'm not going to sell tongs and tankers. I'm not going to carry those around. It does me no good. So I'm just going to throw this junk away and hope that the guards don't catch me. I do not endorse littering in real life. I do not pick up trash if you see it. Clean up nature. That PSA for the day. But what I am saying is, a lot of this stuff you don't necessarily need to be carrying around. And even ancient Nord daggers are worth five gold. They're not going to really get you anything. I kept one. I have one stashed away because it's kind of a novelty item. It's one that I don't see very often, so it's kind of a collection thing. But, I mean, let, let's take a look at this. Because I pulled out an elven helmet. I can sell this, and you can get those at really any time in game. So, whether by crafting or by buying them from a merchant. So, I'm not too worried about it. And I have a glass helmet already, so that would be a better armor class. Except I've got something that's enchanted, so... It's a high, I have a hide helmet of major archery. And a hide helmet, I mean, weight of 2, value of 25. I could sell it, but I'm not too worried about it. I, I'm just hoping I can, you know, either catch a goldfish at some point, which probably isn't going to happen here because I'm catching junk. Like, you only get a certain number of catches. There are only a certain number of fish at a location, and then you have to move on. Ancient Nord War Axe. Okay, that's an, that's an interesting pull. Not necessarily what I was wanting. So, I'm going to go ahead and move down to Heartwood Mill. This is another one of the fishing locations in the Rift, which I know you've seen this one before on a past video that I've done. Where, and, yeah. And I found Leafnar. I, I let them know, I let this family know. Leave me alone. Okay, okay, why is this kid screaming, leave me alone? Did I, did I do something? I didn't hear a dragon or anything. I'm just fishing. Nothing to see here. A best in Longfin, you know, that's good for, uh... Oh! Hello there. Oh, don't give me a disease, wolf. Go get Star Fox. Oh, oh dear, oh dear. Oh, wow, it censored itself on that bush. Wow, okay. Well, good news, it's dealt with. Let me go back to my uh, nice fishing here. You know, I don't, need, I don't need any more spicy encounters, thank you very much. I'm looking for a nice, relaxing retirement as a Khajiit on the river, okay? Let me catch my lunch. <laughs> Ooh, slaughterfish. Now, sad thing is, I don't think you can uh, separate slaughterfish from the scales in this game. I don't think you can do that. But, I mean, that's an, that's an interesting catch. Don't get me wrong. I might be getting better random number generation here. Nope, that's a salmon. I'm going to... You know what? In, in order to aid this process along, I'm going to look up Goldfish Skyrim. Because, I mean, I need two Goldfish here. One of them for this little kid in Whiterun, who is probably... I don't know how much a little kid is going to pay me for that, to be honest. Another Glassfish. No, I, I'm, I'm curious. I'm curious now. Um... Okay, uh, so apparently, so looking this up, apparently there are some very specific locations that you can catch goldfish at, and, okay, so, small pond just north-northeast of Falkreath, okay, There's also one at Mara's Eye Pond, Clear Spring Tarn, Clear Pine Pond. And 
six outside Stony Creek Cave. So, let me see here. North of Rifton and East March, okay. Oh, I, I know where that is. It, it's, it's like faces to names. It, that's a place that I haven't been yet in game. This playthrough, so that would that would be a fun journey to make. Let, I want to make sure I'm going the right direction here, though. This is farther from the road than I'm farther from the road than I thought it was. But yeah, looks like we're gonna need to journey here. Over the hills and through the woods. I mean, you know how the song goes. We're not going to grandmother's house, though. No, no. We're hunting for goldfish in game. Like, seriously. Goldfish. Do you not have a tropical pet store around here in Skyrim? Come on. I could just buy one for, say, 5, 10 gold. And it wouldn't be that bad. But. I, I don't think. I don't think I get that lucky. I think. I think it's gonna make, I, yeah, I I can't just go to a store and say, hey, I'd like to buy two goldfish from you. No, no, that's that would completely defeat the purpose of trying to fish. Also, there is an imperial soldier who is firing at something. What that something is, I can't yet see. Oh. Ah, I got poisoned. <laughs> Goodbye, ugly. So yeah, that that hurt. Good news is I have an Imperial Soldier on my side. Bad news is Frostbite Spiders do a lot of damage. No. Like, especially if you get poisoned, it's bad. Oh, I'll take the steel arrows, the silver ring you left behind, and the frostbite venom. Thank you very much, that is all mine, I'm confiscating that, you can't stop me. Also, made it to, I believe this is shore stone? Yes, this is shore stone, and they do, so they've got a forge here, they have a little bit of a mine. And they call it a mine! A mine! And no, I did not just play an audio tape on that. That was me trying to do a voice and probably failing at it. I mean, I'm using headset that I have with microphone. It's it's not like the one I had previously that was better than this. But I mean, it'll do. Oh dear, what happened? What happened here? This this looks bad. What have we got here? We got anything good here? Oh, there's a note here. Imperial letter. Lieutenant Amkia, a scouts report a band of rebels advancing on your position. Be on guard. Reinforcements are on the way. Yeah, um, I don't think reinforcements got here like they were supposed to. Yeah, no, this is, ooh, yeah, ooh, yeah, uh, I think something bad happened here. Something really bad happened. 100 gold and lockpicking increased to 37. I will definitely take that. I like that. But... Now, now we're just getting distracted here. There's fishing that has to be done. Oh, hi, Fox. Are you going to lead me to treasure? I, sorry, I already found it in the tower. No, I, I literally just learned the other day watching, uh, watch, watching a YouTube video. It was, you know, it was on uh, various secrets that have, that, game developers and that sort of thing have later gone on to confirm. And one of them was that foxes do indeed, or can indeed, lead you to treasure. Oh look, an another fox. Is it going to lead me to treasure? I'm not sure about that, but I heard a bear. Which is terrifying, because I did not see it. Where are you going, little fox? Where are you going? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay, okay. I mean, I can definitely 
follow you. You're probably you're probably leading me right towards a bear, aren't you? That would be funny. Wouldn't it? That would just be absolutely hilarious. So what's the punchline here? Hmm? Oh, there it is. You know, well, I mean, not gone, just farther down the mountain. Oh boy. See, there's the punchline. I told you that bear was leading me right towards. Or I told you that fox was leading me right towards the bear. I knew it. Oh. And it's not just any bear, it's it's a cave bear. It's it's the more terrifying version of bears in game. Actually, correct slight correction on that. There's an even more terrifying version of that. That I don't want to I don't want to spoil it. Because it's find that way later in game. <laughs> Oh, that'll do it. That'll do it, I think. That bear is done. Oh, and yeah, I'm still carrying a fishing rod. That's gonna do me a lot of good against a bear. Oh, and a, a frostbite spider. You know what? I will just leave you be. I already took one of your kin, one of your brethren out. I don't need to, I don't need to do that a second time. No matter how ugly you might be in-game. Hey, there's the fox again. And actually, it's leading me towards an old ancient Nord ruin here. Anselfund. Oh, gosh, no. That's a bad magician. I don't... I don't want to deal with you right now. I'm just fishing. I will eventually come back and give you a bad day. But until then, it's not worthwhile. Now look at this little camp here. It, it's cute, you know? It's uh probably dangerous. Prob most certainly dangerous. Oh. Oh, Craigslane Cavern. Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um yeah, Pit Wolf. This is an illegal wolf fighting ring that is being run here. Oh, there, there's the bouncer. Do your worst. Oh wow, that did much more damage than I thought it would. Oh no. Oh. Oh gosh. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna walk away from that. That was that was brutal. But I'm not going to break up the illegal uh, pit fighting operation right now. I'm. I just want to go. I just want to go fishing in game. Man, that bouncer got bounced though. That was just ooh. Well, good news. This is the location. This is Stony Creek Cave. So let's go ahead. Right. I switched off of the fishing rod. <sighs> Cannot fish while in combat. Really? Who would want to be in combat with me, I wonder? Show you. Yourself. I guess I can make an exception for you. I, I said I wasn't going to take any more of your brethren out. Ooh, a thief? A th Wait. Was there a thief down there, or was the thief there? No, no, that's a skeever. Come here, you rat. But this is good news. Oh. Yeah, there was a thief down this way. They were going to try to steal from me. So, okay, here's the, here's the frostbite spider. I know, I'm getting sidetracked. But the prospects of there being a thief here means that I might find some good stuff. I might find some good loot. There they are. There they are. I should have come here. Oh, don't do that to me. My own brethren. 
Another Khajiit out here. You're trying to steal from me. Your mistake. Yes. Dragon. <laughs> You'll be feeling that one tomorrow. Oh, <laughs> he's getting back up. Run. <laughs> Run for your life. Run away. <laughs> Oh, stuck on a rock. Excellent. Excellent. You really didn't think this one through, did you? You thought you could just go after Felix Oddball? You thought you could steal from me? No, no, I just want to go fishing. Oh, increased my archery skill too. You know, I don't even need a bow for this last one. Goodbye, Joe. Goodbye. <laughs> and that is why you never try to steal from me. An emerald, two lockpicks, some elven hide armors, a torturer's hood. That's terrifying. Also, armor class of 21. That's interesting for a hood. I have not seen that really in game. Maybe, maybe that was added with the uh, anniversary edition. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, no, my, my surprise on shouting a spider down a mountain and seeing a thief pop up because he was trying to run up on the road. Okay, fine, I will equip my fishing rod. Gosh, okay. Let's see if I can find some goldfish here. Maybe maybe they like the cold. I don't know. Okay. Get nibbles. A brook bass. That is not a goldfish. Let's try this again, shall we? As a little light snowstorm blows in. Okay, nibbles, nibbles, excellent. What have we got? Got anything good here? There we go, a goldfish. So I need to catch a second goldfish. I need a second goldfish. So I can, you know, take care of two birds with one stone here. I can start finishing up some bounties. Nope, that's an Abassian Longfin. Good for fortify restoration, but I don't need it right now. I, I'm i good restoration-wise right now. I don't need that. Thank you for offering, but no. I need a goldfish. Give me a goldfish, please. That's a brook bass. I don't need brook bass. Don't give me brook bass. I want goldfish. Oh, now we're catching troll skulls. So apparently my ru my luck has run out here. That's uh because it, e it even shows uh, some well, it shows some interesting fish and fishing supplies. You know what? Ah, uh, no, no, no. I'm not. I'm not gonna go in. I was, so another location, fishing-wise, I know that I said was uh, Mara's Eye Pond, which I believe is up, up in the northern parts here of uh, Solid, near Solitude. I could be wrong. I don't think I'm that far off, though. And no, I'm not going to be delivering Meridus. That is not what I want to do right now. Also, a lot of also's here. Fainting goats. Because I have a mod for it. I see a couple of farmers have just spawned in. That's it happened fun. so fast. One minute the dragon was there, the next it was gone. Okay, little house on the map here. I don't really want to go there right now. No, I'm wanting to go to Mars Eye Pond, which, if I remember correctly, is overrun by Spriggans, so that, that'll 
probably proof would be less than ideal. Yeah, I yeah I think I'm heading to the right place. It, it's not this cave here. That's that's Wolf Skull Cave. No. Uh, yeah, I, I believe this is the way that I'm wanting to go. Yeah, who who knew it could be so hard to find goldfish? Good goldfish. Okay. I think. Well, I could be wrong. Also, fishing rod isn't going to do any good against brigands. No. I need good old-fashioned bow and arrow, plus stealth, and not an insignificant amount of luck. Boosh! Okay. I didn't see anything stir there, so that's interesting. I see we have a nice logging operation here. Someone probably doesn't enjoy that very much. Ooh, detected. Detected and hidden again. So I think... I think it's a trap I have to spring. Oh no, this is Clear Pine Pond. That's actually fortunate, though. That's fortunate. Because... Clear Pine Pond is another location that I can find goldfish at. By fishing. Now, I'm going to guess that the fishing location is going to be on that central island, which, as I said before, is going to have Spriggan on it. <sighs> Ooh, there's an elk. Th there's an elk there. I kind of want the small antler. Oh, wow. You have a lot more health than I thought you did. And there's an aforementioned Spriggan, turning itself invisible to try to chase me down. Actually, three Spriggans. Uh, 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 uh. Look at them all running around there. That's definitely an ideal way to draw them out. They don't like it when you mess with the local fauna, with the wildlife. Okay, I'll take that uh, sneak attack there. That's nice. Oh, turning yourself invisible. I can still see you. You're not that hidden. Another hit there. Now, Spriggans, when they go down, they do tend to heal themselves. So, bear that in mind. This might take a little bit longer because of that. Doing good amounts of damage on all of them. And they have no idea where I'm at. This is excellent. Just have to wait for them to slow down a little bit, you know. Get them to stop, and then they go down on one knee. There's the healing factor. Okay, one's friggin' down. That one's gonna go investigate. I missed it. Oh, I missed- Oh no, I hit that one, it ran right into it. He's gonna go back and investigate on that side there. Oh, hold breath, ran out. That's fine, I can still hit it. It's healing itself. Not that it's gonna do it any good. That's two down, one to go. Alright, that one over there. Hello. Hello. Oh. Okay, if, I think it turned the elk into a friendly of its. Because it says there's a red dot there. It says there's an enemy. But I'm not seeing any more spriggans. Now, there could be a fourth one. Like, let's, let's not discount that option. There could be a fourth spriggan. But at the moment, it appears to be quiet. I don't Hmm. Where did where did the spriggan end up at? I know I was uh hitting them around here. Okay, here's a flower basket. Oh, an alchemist. Ooh, de ru de rum derenis. I think I've read this one already. Also, I actually took it instead of reading it. Let's uh, read it. Okay, yep, I've read it already. Uh, I'm just gonna drop it back here with the alchemist. It's fine. 
I don't need to take it with me in game right now. Not too worried about it. Okay. So there, there's probably a fishing location here, right? There's probably fishing supplies. Unless this is one of those locations where you just have to do the good old fashioned swim through the water and just catch stuff. Oh. Oh no, it's a... It's a snow fox that is angry with me. Okay. Well, that's... Hello. Oh! Jerk. <laughs> you jerk. It bit me! <laughs> it bit me! <laughs> Don't like it. Okay, it says there's another enemy here. Oh, it's that uh, elk. Okay. Elk is taken care of. I still... Still have not found a fishing location. Ah, there's a Spriggan. Spriggan Sap. Now, that's good for fortifying chanting, if I remember correctly. Uh... Okay, let me consult the wiki again, because... Well... I'm wanting to find goldfish. Also, there there's more to this island than meets the eye. Like, aside from finding the alchemist there and Derurs, I'm forgetting its name already, but now this chest here, which I almost missed. Uh, 40 gold. Okay, I will take that. Clear Pine Pond Fishing Location. Uh, hmm. I mean, obviously, it's going to be next to the water somewhere, right? I could just be, I might just be an idiot as well. Let's see here. Oh, that's not... That's not loading. Okay. Well, might just have to do this the old-fashioned way then. See if I can find some goldfish in here. Oh, this... Ah! There you are. Hello there. Yeah, no, there's there's no fishing location here officially, it looks like. Which is a shame. I, I would have done the legit thing to catch those goldfish, but I ended up just swimming after them. It's, it's fine, you know. It, you do what you have to do. But now, let's go make a client happy. And try not to eat these along the way, because after all, I am a cheat in game. It's no I work with my mother, to sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most days, but hard work. I heard that you'd like a pet goldfish. What do you think of this one? Could I keep him? Please? Sure. Here you go. You're the best. Thanks. Okay, I need to follow her now, it says. Interesting. Interesting. Thank you. Here, this is for you. One gold piece. Well, that's definitely lucrative. Work? 
It might suit you. Ask Furia about additional fishing bounties around Skyrim. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, sure. Why not? But I thought I was working on Catch of the Day, Return to Swims in Deep Water. Which is actually going to be in the same location. At the uh, Riften Fishery. So... You know what? That's that's fine. And you know what? I found all these fish for you. Maybe you can give me, I don't know, a little bit of a gold reward, maybe? I don't know. A fishing rod? Maybe prompt me to go get one? I would like a fishing rod. I don't think I'm that far in the fishing quest line, though. That's, that's the thing. Which is unfortunate. Oh. Another unfortunate thing is I... I climbed on the wrong yes? part of... Please yeah. help oh. me. I'm going to move yeah, my yeah. job at the Out with it. No, if anyone needs a fishing work around Skyrim. You're headed to Morthal. It's all in this note. Ah. Also, it uh, looks like your uh, juvenile mudcrab there is growing up fast. I see he's following you around. It would seem so. Oh, that's until all you have to say. Time. Okay, and, and until next time. Again. Thank you. It's yours now. I won't. Avon Shamzel, take it to Avon Shamzel. You must take it back. All right. Hello, swims in deep water. You have questions? Here are the fish you asked for. You've done well. Ah, 200 gold. I'm ready for the next fishing challenge. It's all in this note. I see these fish come out in the rain, and you lost your lucky fishing hat. It speaks the truth. It speaks the truth. All right. Uh, I'll be back soon with the fish and the hat. My thanks to you. My thanks to you. Need something? Also, uh, I'm... Any other work that you have, I'm looking for. I understand. It's all in this note. Ah, so many notes, so many notes. Supply of catfish. Ooh, interesting. Okay, you want uh, catfish. Uh, and uh, fish you can only catch in the rain. Uh, supply of catfish, here we go. Our in supply of catfish has begun to run low, and I fear that what we have left won't last long. A reward waits any who can bring me three catfish to help replenish our stock. Feta, Dragon Bridge. Okay. Um. Yeah, okay. So, catfish caught in the rain. So, I need Fish Up Swims in Deep Water's Lucky Fishing Hat and read the list of rainy weather fish, which is going to be down here. I've hit a string of bad luck. No matter how hard I try, the fish do not bite. The, my memory fails me like a goldfish. The whole thing is bad for business. Of course, there's a logical explanation for all of it. I've lost my lucky fishing hat. I once had a priestess of Kinnereth bless it for good fortune. You may not believe it, but I swear that rain. It rains wherever I, whenever I go fishing while wearing it. It's true. Oh, how I miss it. The rain did wonders for my scales. A high wind blew it off my head and into the water on my last fishing trip just west of Serethi Fawn. Perhaps you could find it? Speaking of rain, the fish for your next challenge are only found on a rainy day. Catfish, pearlfish, pygmy sunfish, and spadefish. The second volume of Fishing Mastery has details on these particular uh, peculiar fish. Good luck. I can't wait for these wonderful fish and for my hat to return to its rightful place on the top of my head. Well, okay. Well, let me just double check that. Um, just west of Serethi Farm. Okay. So, Serethi Farm is... No, that's Hartwood Mill. That's Serethi Farm. So, just west. So, his hat is going to be there. Let me see if there's good fishing location. Anywhere nearby. Um, yeah, that's that's the correct direction. So, let's head that way. It's a little uh, waterfall here stream. That's kind of nice. It's kind of cool. Um, I don't... Yeah, I don't think that this has a fishing location at it. No. No, it doesn't. It just... 
it just springs up from here. Oh, that's that's a lot of Nern root. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. Please, someone do something. Oh no! 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 Absolutely not! Cultists and frostbite spiders, and they don't seem to be fighting each other. This is bad. This is really bad. This is oh so bad. Ooh, critical strike! It almost hit me with its uh, with its venomous uh, spittle. Okay. They brought in a flame atronach. Now if I could shout them down this cliff, that would be excellent. It would definitely even the odds a little bit. And I'm definitely fighting more cultists that can heal themselves, which is not great. Why is that frostbite spider not fighting them? Unless they're using some magic to make it their ally. They probably are. Oh. Okay, they're searching around. This time around, I think I have a little more advantageous position than I did the first time I went against cultists. So that's at least good. Also, this is going to hurt you, not me. There you go, yep. Just take a little bit of fire. Oh, you don't know. One call is down. I am better prepared than I was last time. Excellent. That went... That definitely went better than last time. Two cultists wa two cultists washed up and no place to go. I'll take a death bell, potion of destruction. I don't need your clothing. Don't want your clothing. Oh, that was the one I had searched for. Other one had some gold. Take an iron arrow back. Excellent. Good, good. That was Oh. Ah, of course he used a ward. Right, there's a third one. There's always... See, the first time they approached me, there were only two. Now there's... Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Gosh, gosh. This is bad. I'm burning up here. I'm burning, I'm burning. Yeah, you know. You get the idea. Send me on fire! And all the fire Anyways, I think I'll dispatch this one in the same way I dispatched the others. Stealthily, with arrows. I shall not fall. No, I shall not fall. Really. I have arrows the other one. Not getting sneak attack anymore, that's bad. Mm. Oh boy. Yeah, armor. Sadly, taking fire damage, taking a fire bolt or a fireball does not aid in armor class. I'll find you. I'll find you. Will you now? Will you now? Oh, you wasted your ward. A jump. Uh, I think that'll do it. Yep. He's done. Lesser soul gem and some arrows. And the cultists are dealt with. Cultists round two, I think I take this one by a staggering victory. You ought to know better than to mess with the likes of Felix Oddball. So just remember that, next time 
You try to go up against me, you try to go up against Felix Oddball, don't. Just don't. Absolutely not. Don't do it. Bad idea. Gourds. Wow, I found gourds in the wild. I don't really need them. Oh, hey, they're those uh, uh, treasure hunters from before. I know I've disrupted their dig before. Uh, shall I do it again? That's the question. I could definitely sneak over there. Treasure hunter, treasure hunter. They both have daggers. So that's not so worrying. Um, some gold and silver ruby ring. Ah, they don't seem too concerned about me this time around. That's good. Hello. Oh. oh. Alright, alright. I'll back off. I'll back off. Okay. Now, where the hat is, it seems to be pointing me to a specific location. I'm thinking it might be a specific fishing location on the island here. Yes, that would be the case. Excellent. Granted, it's not raining, so I can't really... Fine, I'll get the fishing rod out. Ah! Yeah, so I can't really catch the uh, fish that you can while it's raining. I don't think... I don't... I don't think I can. Unless... And there's the lucky fishing hat for swims in deep waters. That was easy. Now let's see what fish are around here. I know it's not raining, but it definitely looks like it could rain in game. So let's see what we find. You know, what what have we got? Silver set perch. Okay, that's fairly common. Also, you'll notice that tower there near Laim. That's that's one of them. My, that that's a location I really like in game because it's it's kind of a simple place. Ooh, a slaughterfish, excellent. Not what I, not what I need for these fishing bounties, but I mean, oh well, oh well. Also, I said this video was gonna be shorter. And it is going to be shorter than the videos I've been doing recently, which are upwards of two hours, you know, two, two and a half hours. This one, probably hour and a half, you know, it's not the most exciting thing. I mean, it, it definitely features some battles and gameplay. I mean, <laughs> a, a sneaky thief that wasn't so sneaky earlier, the hunt for goldfish, find, the finding of the lucky fishing hat. And you know what? In a couple of minutes here, I'll probably head over to Nilhaim Nil there and just kind of poke around, explore, see if I can find anything good over there, loot-wise. Honed Ancient Nord Warhammer. Wow, okay. That put me uh, 18 over the limit. 26 damage, 29 there's a reason I don't want to use this one. There, there's a reason whenever I've passed by it in um, in burial grounds and that sort of thing that I have not picked it up. It's because I have things that are comparable to that damage-wise that I think weigh a few units less. So that is good news. You know, I, I'm glad to catch things like that, but at the same time, I don't really want it. Especially since its sale price is so low anyways. The thing about the Ancient Nord items is, apparently they're not collector's items. You know, it's none of that Indiana Jones that belongs in a museum. No, it belongs in a burial ground. People don't, people don't want to buy that. People don't want to buy those things. They're just not collectible. So, yep, let's head over to Nilheim and see what that's all about. What have we got here? We got anything good here. Just uh, 
making my way up there. Making my way up there. Yeah, you know, that that sort of thing. Also, um Oh. Ooh, there's a fishing contest. I didn't even notice that. Ah, notice, fishing contest. Notice, I hereby challenge any who would read this notice to a fishing contest. Let us, let us test our mettle and place bets on who the greatest fisher this side of the Karth River really is. I shall match any wager, so bet as much as you dare. I warn you, however, that none have bested me. In fact, every challenger that has faced me has never set foot in Morthal again. No doubt out of shame. Meet me on the docks if you think you're up to it. Brutius. Et a brute? Started. No contest. Hmm. Ah. Nilaim. Yes. This place is never should have come here. No sign of him. Well, I mean, it says guards. What are they guarding, I wonder? You know what? Let's go up into the tower and find out. Because it appears they are asleep on the job. They are not they're not doing what they're supposed to. Ooh, an iron mace. I really don't need that. Pickpocket a guard. Some gold and a venison shop. Now I don't think I can do this splinter cell style and just sneak past them. I don't I don't think that's gonna be possible. It's probably going to require an unrelenting force shot. Sneak by oh Oh, he almost saw me. Almost. He's walking right by me. He doesn't care. Okay. That's interesting. Petty soul gem. A coin purse. Another guard. What are they guarding? I don't know. And there's a chest up here. Let's search the chest. 39 gold. Okay, it's not as lucrative as I thought it was going to be. But I mean, if they're not going to be hostile towards me up here, I mean, they're definitely friendlier than their counterparts down below or sneak past him. He didn't even notice me that time. Why why would they try to attack me? That's that's what I wonder. What what is going on here that would cause them to try to do me harm. Okay, you, you grunted. Grunted. Need something. Need something. Okay. What what have you got in your chest? Some gold, a scroll of call to arms. You are not getting hostile towards me. I like that. Thank you. I mean, it, it's not stealing if you're letting me do this. I, I don't like to steal, personally. I don't. But, I mean, it, it's not stealing, so it's not an issue. Still, though, I, I do wonder what you're guarding. Yes. Yes. Oh, this is fun. See this, see this card here? A nice one. Under one before shout does nothing. So instead, you have to push it towards the edge. It's not going to go clean. Not usually. And then you just push it off the cliff and there goes. You just watch it wheel its way down the mountain. Crash and burn style. Although it didn't go as far as I thought it was going to. So let's uh, let's uh, give it another shove here off a cliff. There, a nice little waterfall. Excellent. Excellent. But now I'm on the edge of a rock, so I need to uh, make my way down to this waterfall as well. And, you know, we'll just uh, skip to the good bit. We'll just... Uh, you know, r optional read Fishing Mastery Volume 2. I think that would be a good idea for this, because, honestly, I have no idea what I'm doing concerning that. Heard they were forming a dawn guard. Vampire hunters or something in the old fort near Rift. Hold up. Who are you? Uh, Grelka. Uh, 
You have questions. Purveyor of I'll light armor. I'll, I'm going to lose my Ooh, that was uh, Viria. I'm waiting. Oh, never mind. She doesn't have anything more for me. Guess I'm gonna have to read that book. And then... And then, after reading the book, that'll probably be a good stopping point for this bonus content video, you know? It's kind of a slow one. Not much going on. Oh! Good thing I have a key! I can get in any time. Right, here it is. Fishing Mastery Volume 2. Come rain or shine, the fish will bite. Well, some fish come when it shines, others when it rains. For our next lesson, we will focus on the latter. The fish in this guide come to the surface more often than the rain in the temperate parts of Skyrim. Some say they like the rain, or that they are gloomy fish who hate the sun. In truth, they enjoy watching the ripples dance along the surface above them and want to join in on the festivities. Even fish want to enjoy themselves from time to time. For advice on where to fish, refer to the first volume of this illustrious series of guides. The places are the same. The only difference is rain. For a change of pace, try fishing along the White River east of White Run, and follow it south to Lake Inalta. All right. Well, that gives that certainly gives a good location of where to go. So. It said, yeah, along, I believe it said along this river here. Where's Lake Inalta? Wait, White, the White River, White River. You know, I'm going to go back in there and read. I it's didn't, yours. I did not retain what I just Avanchal read there, Zell. sadly. That, take it to that's Zell. not usual for me. You must take it Hello back. there, Goldie. You're looking good. Nice goldfish. Uh, let's let's go back into that along the White River east of White Run and follow it south to Lake Inalta. So, yep, look, east of White Run. Yep, and follow it to Lake Inalta, which I believe is. That. That, I believe, is Lake Inalta. So, I'm going to go ahead and set a custom destination waypoint just arbitrarily on the river. And hopefully I'll, that'll remind me that I need to go there for fishing. But hey, thank you for watching this bonus content video on fishing. I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment on what else you'd like to see me do. I will definitely be returning to fishing in Skyrim. Sometime in the future, I don't know exactly when, but be looking for that one when it drops. I will make sure that they have titles like bonus content, gone fishing 1, gone fishing 2, you know, that sort of thing. So until then, have a good night, lurdy, <laughs> lurdy, <laughs> nerdy librarian out, have a good night.